Makerspace, design, and tinkering are all anyone is talking about right now. Students are creating incredible things in design programs. 3D printers, microcontrollers, Arduinos, and Makey Makeys. Students and schools are building new spaces, creating new classes, and changing the way we teach STEM. It's awesome. Transdisciplinary units and project-based learning are all letting teachers collaborate in amazing ways. It's changing the way we teach. All this design doesn't happen overnight. Creating these programs is a huge undertaking that requires time, knowledge, and effort to do right. Building a design program, especially across multiple schools and curriculum, can push teachers and admin far past their comfort zone. Once you get a design program, how do you maintain it? How do you get the right classes, teachers, equipment, tools, and materials to help your students create the best possible projects? It's not easy, but it's worth it. Building a design program and have questions, I've got the session for you. Come to Makerspace Nuts and Bolts at Learning 2. It's November 1st through the 3rd at American School in Japan. This session will present how to build, maintain, and run an innovative and effective design program. Let's all make more cool stuff. I'm Mike Bycraft. I teach design, robotics, and makerspace at Korea International School. I've taught design in every grade from kindergarten to high school. We've created a robust K-12 design program that we've built over the last four years. I'll present different types of classes, number of staff, classes to offer, curriculum, standards, good and bad tools, equipment you need, consumables you're going to run out of, and project-based learning programs I've worked with. In addition, we'll talk about transdisciplinary units, projects, how to collaborate with other departments, and some cool things you can do with your school across grade levels and across curriculum. We'll have a few design challenges thrown in and play with some cool technology. Come for the knowledge, stay for the banana pianos and raspberry pies. Hope to see you there at Learning 2 2018 in Tokyo.